Hey guys, it's Kiki, and today I'm going to be doing a plan with me for August 2019. So I'm really excited to do this video because August is my birthday month and I'm going to be using the new Mild Liner brush pens. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. So first, I'm going to start off with the usual box in the middle. Then I wrote August in the middle in calligraphy using a black brush pen. Since this month's theme is geometric shapes, I decided to draw some triangles, circles, rectangles and things like that all around the square in the middle using different colours and highlighters. For the monthly spread, I started off by writing August at the very top using one of my mild liner brush pens. Then I ruled out rectangles for every day of the month. Then I wrote the days of the week at the top of each row in capital letters. Then I numbered the dates 1 to 31 in the corner of each box using a coloured pen. For the space at the very top, I made a section for notes. Then for the leftover space, I decided to draw some more shapes in different colours. For the to-do and note spread, I decided to do the same thing as I did in my June spread. So basically it was just three different rectangles, one for to-do, one for don't do and one for notes. So after I ruled out the boxes, I went in with my light pink mild liner brush pen and wrote the titles at the very top. Then of course in the corner of a rectangle, I decided to draw some more shapes. For the sleep tracker, I started off with the same grid and then I just highlighted the top in grey and the left hand side in the light pink. Then I just numbered the times at the very top and did the dates and the days of the week down the left hand side. For the title, I just went in with my grey mild liner brush pen and just wrote sleep tracker at the very top. Then obviously with the leftover space, I drew some more shapes. For the weekly spread, I started off by writing AUG at the very top in calligraphy. Then I wrote the dates next to it. Then I drew four boxes on each page for each day of the week and then the last box will be for notes. And then I wrote the days of the week at the very top of each box from Monday to Sunday and then I wrote notes in the last box. Then I went ahead and just dated each of the boxes in the corner. Of course, this spread wouldn't be complete without the shapes at the very top. And I really like this spread because you can really customize it as you can use any of the space in the boxes for anything you would like. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed, comment down below if any of you are born in the month of August and if you guys have any suggestions for the month of September, please let me know down below. As always, make sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up and comment down below what video you would like me to do next. Bye guys, see you next time!